everybody. It's daytime. I'm outside in my backyard and I thought it would be interesting to introduce you to my studio. So I'm going to uh, turn around and we'll go inside. Um, this is the art studio. We built this. It's not clean. I'm just going to let you know that. It's a mess because it's a workspace. Um, and uh, oh, there's so much going on in here. There's exercise equipment and boxes. I'm going to turn on the light so you can see a little better. Um, over here I have my lifetime supply of art stuff, the things that I've just been collecting and holding on to and thinking maybe I'll use that someday. And I am starting to use them, which is a big deal for me uh, because, you know, so much of my life as an artist, I have said, oh, well, I can't use that. That's really good. And I want to save the good stuff for the best art. So I can't do that right now, which has prevented me from making the best art. Uh, so I'm starting to try to overcome that. And here is, you know, it's just a work table with a lot of garbage on it. And over here is a pile of wood that I've been, you know, thinking someday I will use that. And we'll see. We'll see um, if that ever happens. There's a giant cardboard box that is maybe going to be a prop in a show later this summer uh, with Petra and Prismagic. Um, back over here, we have another room. Here's a piece of art I did many years ago um, about angel cards. And maybe I'll go through and read some of the poetry at some point. Um, there's me. Hello. This is what I look like. Um, and in this room, it's full of costumes and, uh, hats and props and things going up to the ceiling. We have the fabric dummy and the Sharif and Sharif and Sharif costume and boots. We have, um, bags of magic carpet costumes and, oh, what's over here? We have the, um, party masks and graduation hats, pride boas and ears, wigs, more props, fencing masks. This says costumes, nun, unicorns, belly dance, knight, and fur. So we have, and then we have whole racks and racks and racks of costumes um, that we've collected through our life of theatricality. Uh, also boots and this is one of Howard's posters. Um, props that we haven't put back yet after borrowing or lending them. And then, uh, you know, just a sort of a space of one can do yoga and uh, talk on a prop telephone if one chooses to do so. And for a little while I was using this as a meditation space, which I, I still do every once in a while. There's a, a box full of glasses of a variety of kinds. Uh, a calendar that is two years old. And again, more hats up on top. And then out here we have our workshop of power tools and projects that have been discarded. Uh, many, 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 many boxes of files uh, and, and stuff up on the top. And then again, more power tools, electrical cords and stuff that goes to God knows what, um, a wall of tools over here, uh, and then a wall of juggling equipment that belongs to Howard. Uh, there's his poster from Jewel of the Nile. Um, so when he wants to juggle, he gets to do that. And then here's my current work table where I'm busy um, I've got some collages over here that I worked on as a collage I made and a collage that Howard made earlier this week and stamps and uh, clay and runes that I'm trying to figure out to make. So I'm going to invite you all to come on this journey with me. There's a couple pieces of art in here. Here's, here's one that's a mobile. Um, and, and again, maybe I'll introduce each of these pieces of art at some point. Um, here's another piece of art that came to me in a dream and uh, perhaps I'll walk you all through some of these pieces of art at some point. Anyway, that's a brief introduction to my studio today and uh, maybe I'll go do some projects now. Thanks, see you later.